to start this paper towel magic project, you need some paper towels. You're gonna need a dish that you can put some water in, just big enough to hold your paper towel. You need a Sharpie or a black marker, and you're also going to need some markers. Any colors will work. Go ahead and get your paper towel roll. Rip off one sheet off of that paper towel roll. You want to lay it horizontally and fold it in half, just like you're folding a card. You wanna get those edges as nice and neat and lined up as you can and make a crease. All right, get ready, cause it's time to make some magic. Get your paper towel ready. Make sure that you folded it just like a card. And we are going to start drawing on the outside with a Sharpie. I am starting with a fish. You can start by drawing anything you want. It works best if you draw a picture of something simple or familiar on the outside, like I'm doing a fish. I'm adding scale details. I'm adding coral, seaweed, sand, seashells, whatever you draw on the front, you can add all those details to. And this is just gonna be simple black and white. When you're done with that drawing, open it up, and this is where you get your markers ready. Choose your colors and begin coloring inside. I'm coloring all over the inside of my paper towel with ocean colors, since I drew a fish under the sea. You can even add designs, swirls, patterns. It doesn't necessarily have to look like anything on the inside. I'm just making mine look like ocean colors. Make sure that you're only coloring on one half of the inside of your paper towel, just like I did. Get your dish ready with a little bit of water, just enough to put your paper towel in. Let's see what happens. As you can see, when your paper towel gets wet, the colorful markers come through and it makes a beautiful picture. You can make as many of these as you want. You can do something like a rainbow, an animal, a food, a silly picture, words. You can spell your name, use any colors that you want. If you do something like a rainbow where you want it to line up on the inside, you might need to go back over and trace over your lines more than once so that it bleeds through and you can trace it on the inside. That might make it a little bit easier to line up what you're coloring. For example, I colored my rainbow in rainbow order and I wanted to make sure all the colors would be in the right place when I dipped it in the water. I had to trace over those arched lines with my black Sharpie more than once to make sure that they were nice and neat. Did you know that you can also make super cool cards using the paper towel magic trick? Mother's Day is coming up and I'm gonna show you how to make a Mother's Day card. I started by drawing a simple heart using my black Sharpie on the front of my paper towel. I got my markers ready. I'm using red and I'm spelling out the word mom, M-O-M. I decided to trace it in my black Sharpie as well, but you don't have to do that. You can use whatever colors you want and you can add whatever details you want. It's up to you. This card is special for whoever you want it to be for. Let's see what happens when we dip it in the water. This is a time for you to get creative and have fun. What do you think that you can create with a paper towel and a marker? I can't wait to see.